All right, uh, one. <laughs> I found some tangerines in my in my reefer here. And I'm about to enjoy these little bad boys. Um, but I want to tell you something. People that are putting prices on XRP, you need to understand the three phases of this. One, it's not being used right now for what it was intended to be used. Right now, people are just buying, speculating, and stuff like that. Okay, it's not really being used fully for the cross borders payment settlement, whatever. But then there's the other one. This is where it's gonna get crazy. This is where you're gonna see a blow up of this price, fucking ridiculous. And everybody knows this. This is not even. This is not me. Oh, Lufen versus Wall Street said that. No, listen. Everybody in the in the in the world of this knows this. Banking, financial, Wall Street, whatever, government. Everybody knows this. When XRP is used on the back end to sell out all these derivatives and stock trades, let me tell you something, that's where you're gonna see this shit blow out of proportion. So it's not right now people speculating, is it gonna go to 80 cents? Is it, is it gonna go to a dollar? No. Is, is it really being used right now for cross-border payments? Eh. But when it starts to be used to settle out all the, all the world trends, all the derivatives, everything, do you, do you even understand what that will mean? Like, yeah, like that level. So that's the price. The price is you can't fucking come up with a price because nobody knows how big this shit is. I was just talking to uh, Elk Spaghetti. He just reminded me the Rothschilds heavily into this. Think about it. Those motherfuckers are heavily into this. Those Luciferian fucks. So anyway... That's how it goes, <laughs> off to the tangerines.